Get a check on the weather with Storm Team Meteorologist Dave Nussbaum for the latest. Well, Kristen, it's been wonderful the last couple of days. We'll do it one more day today with some sunshine out there this lunch hour. Perfect to go find your favorite place to eat lunch outdoors, your favorite food truck as well. 80 degrees, a nice little breeze out there, but the dew point 45, that's some dry air across the area. We're in the 80s from Moundville through Tuscaloosa, Alabaster, Talladega there, back over toward Innocent. Almost 80 gats in Asheville area, Jasper and Fayette at this hour too. And the winds a little breezy at times, gusting to 25 in Birmingham, 30 the gust there over into Hamilton, 22 in Coleman, so a little breezy, but otherwise not looking too bad. High pressures off to the east of us. You have that southerly flow continuing to work its way into the area here. And as that happens, that's going to allow us to be that warmer air out there today. But there's our next cold front. Not much to it right now, but it will be developing quite a bit of storms as we head into tomorrow and they'll eventually head our way. Today, though, we're looking at mostly sunny this afternoon for that fit forecast. One o'clock at 84, 86 by four, still 80 degrees by seven o'clock this evening. So great for that walk or run outdoors. Highs today from 87 Tuscaloosa to the Alabaster to Jasper area. Same for you in Gadsden. 86 from Birmingham, Springville, Asheville area back to Talladega and Clanton. Maybe even the upper 80s there over into Anniston, well above the average of 76. Now tomorrow morning won't be quite as cool. Upper 50s, midday temperatures near 80 again, but we only stay around 80 for highs. Small chance of rain during the day becoming breezy out there, but the chance of rain will increase later Friday, 30% to about 70 to 80% as we get into Friday night through Saturday morning before drying out Sunday and Monday and another shot of rain next week. Fortunately, we don't have to worry about severe weather with this front, which is some great news and future cast starting tomorrow morning. Briefly clear before clouds start building in, maybe a sprinkle or two around lunchtime. That'll move off to the east of us with some sunshine in the afternoon, but notice the bigger storms in Mississippi. Those could be strong as they head on into western Alabama around 6 p.m. and heading into Birmingham between, say, 8 and 9 o'clock. Not expected to be severe, but we could see some gusty winds and downpours with these storms as they move through and actually impacting all the events on the boulevard there over in Dega there as we get into Friday evening. Now by midnight, most of that rain is gone, but still some lingering showers. But by sunrise here, it's mostly clear on Saturday. A lot of sunshine expected for the day Saturday, which is great for Dega for a day and then the Stallions game on Saturday evening looking pretty good as well. So 72 Saturday with some sunshine, 68 on Sunday with a 68 degree temperature, a little bit below average, but cool and breezy out there. A day looks good too, 68 at noon, but by kickoff off at 72 and then for the stallions not bad at all either temperatures fall from the 60s to the 50s so you want to get jacket for sure for that game and then monday back to 70 and here comes the rain tuesday and into wednesday with a much better chance of storms